The homepage of ResearchPoint is your one-stop prospect search for when you need to find existing or add new prospects to your database. Whether the person is known to you or you only have partial information, this powerful search optimizes your time and information to not only identify your person, but to provide an initial set of highly confident information. We recommend you start from the home page when you need to open an existing or add a new prospect record. To eliminate duplicates, we make it easy for you to first search your database for the prospect before you add them. If you integrate with the Razor's Edge, you can even choose to search all saved prospects in both ResearchPoint and Razor's Edge at once. If the prospect you are looking for doesn't appear in the results, a Prospect Not Found link appears at the top of the results for you to search through the Target Analytics Prospecting Database. The Target Analytics Prospecting Database is a searchable database of more than 200 million households, representing more than 474 million names and addresses. The prospecting database is available for all subscription levels. Based on your subscription level, the search options and data access may vary. For this video, we'll show what it looks like if you have the professional subscription. While not as comprehensive as a full wealth point screening, the prospecting database does provide an initial data set that you can use to identify your prospect. The initial data set covers biographical, real estate, business ownership, securities, and philanthropic giving information. Even if you know the individual well, we recommend you add the individual to ResearchPoint through the Target Analytics Prospecting Database search instead of the Add an Individual form. When you add through the search, you can confirm the address is standardized, find information unknown to you, reduce data entry errors, and eliminate unnecessary typing. For example, we've seen how a slight difference in street address can result in different wealth point screening results. This is something you can detect before you even add a prospect to your database. Let's walk through the one-stop prospect search together. We'll use a prospect we'd all love to have as a major donor, Warren Buffett from Omaha, Nebraska. First, I type in Warren's name and zip code into the name and location fields. For the location, you can enter the city, state, zip, or any combination of them. The field knows how to parse the information for you. If I had a common name that I knew had many entries in my database, I could use the advanced search. However, it is not necessary most of the time. After I click search, I notice that Warren is not a safe prospect in our database yet, so I need to add him. I click the link to search the Target Analytics Prospecting Database. Two results return. In some cases, the prospects may be different people, but in others, it is possible for the same prospect to appear in the search results more than once. This is something we're working to improve for the future, and it tends to happen when a data result for the prospect doesn't get matched to the existing prospect record. In this example, it appears that Warren's relationship to the National Fire and Marine Insurance Company didn't match up to his existing prospect record, which contains a great deal more of his confirmed wealth and his primary business relationship with Berkshire Hathaway. We recommend you add the prospect record with the most wealth information and that matches the information you have on record. If needed, you can manually add additional information after the record is created or use the Find External Properties and Businesses page to add additional properties or businesses to a prospect record. To add the record to your database, click Screen Now. The Add New Individual screen appears with information from the search auto-populating the form. You can review the prospect's name and select a primary address, the spouse's name, and the primary business. Because the prospecting database can return up to five household members, the first person listed in Select Spouse's Name field may not be the spouse. If you know the spouse or primary business, but it's not an option in the drop-down, you can enter the information manually. Next, you have two choices for your workflow. You can leave the screen record on Save checkbox selected and click Save. The new prospect record will appear. You can continue to add information about the prospect while the initial wealth point screening is processing. The record refreshes when the screening is complete. You then should complete an additional screening after you finish adding known information. Or, you can clear the checkbox and wait to complete the wealth point screening until after you add the additional known information about the prospect. For example, if you have Social Media Finder, you will want to complete a wealth point screening after you enter the prospect's known email addresses. No matter which workflow works best for you, just remember that to find the best and most wealth data for a prospect, more criteria equals better results. For example, if you know the full name, address, spouse, date of birth, and email address, we'll be able to more confidently find and match the results for your prospect. 
Without criteria, we can't be confident the results we found match your person. If I was interested in adding a different Warren Buffett than the successful businessman and investor, and he didn't appear in the search results, we first recommend you use the advanced search to tweak the search criteria just in case you filtered out the result you need. For example, instead of a specific zip code or city in Nebraska, I could search the entire state. Advanced search is also useful if you only know partial information and are performing more of a true cold prospecting search. If the prospect you are looking for still doesn't appear, we then recommend you use the Add a New Prospect and Screen Now link at the top of the page. Since the wealth point screening is more comprehensive and not every person in the United States is represented in the prospecting database, it is worthwhile to complete as much information as you know about the individual on the screen and then click Save. In all likelihood, you can still build out a worthwhile profile, especially in cases where the wealth data exists for a couple in one spouse's name, but not the others. For more detailed information about the Target Analytics prospecting search, watch our deep dive into the Target Analytics search video. We cover what each of the search results tiles show, how to customize the tiles, and how to use the advanced search to your needs. And to access all of your Research Point help resources, visit the ResearchPoint how-to documentation page on blackbaud.com.